Okay, so this message came to me as I was working out. Literally, I stopped in the middle. I'm still dripping sweat, but I did learn a long time ago that if a message comes to you at any point, you either write it down or you share with the message that was given to you. So that's what this is. Um, we're all given a dream or a goal, right? This dream or this goal is being symbolized by this candle. When we're young, this dream, this goal is high importance. It's like the only thing we're thinking of. We're not thinking of... Um, the mortgage, we're not thinking of maybe our family, we're thinking of our dream because we're so young, we're so immature with what, we're, what, with what our focus is, but the one thing that we want is this. As we go through life, or as, we, as we're thinking that, nothing can touch this, right? External forces, try and blow this dream out, it can't happen. As we go through life, things get beaten down. We're told you can't do that. That's not going to happen. That's impossible. There's no way you can do that. And eventually what happens is whew, that dream gets blown out. And we graduate. We get married for some of us. We have kids for some of us. And eventually we realize we still have that dream inside of us. And that dream gets relit. It gets restoked. And we start to elevate it. And it elevates. But now, not only do we have the dream... We have other responsibilities as well. We have family, we have friends, we have a mortgage, we have a career. All these things are going on in our life, but yet we have this one dream up here as well. And if this doesn't come along with this, and this is going, we're focusing solely on our dream, we're focusing solely on one element our life, of our life, whether it's your body, you're like focusing so much on fitness that family, other, re other things in your life start to stay low. <sighs> nothing, can touch the, <sighs> nothing can touch that one. But however, <sighs> if you're not careful, these other things that are lower on your value list, on your value structure at the time, can get blown out. And then you get a reminder. You know what? Family is important. And you realize that if you bring these two together, you have family, you have your body, you have your finances, and you have your dream all in the same spot, we're level, external forces can't touch it, you're invincible. And then you realize that there's other things that you may want. So this other thing, and I don't have three hands, <clears throat> another element comes into play, and you start to bring these together, and some go up some days, some go down some days, they're higher on your value list, or some, some may get a little, get the environment starts to blow in a little bit, until you realize that you can have it all. You can have it all. My mentors, David Jackson, Garrett J. White, have shared to me, you can have it all. You may not need a coach. But what you need is support. And you can have it all if you have a community underneath of you holding things up and supporting you. Now, obviously this is a very uh, silly demonstration but hopefully you understand that you can have it all if you surround yourself with the right people i posted something today is you can do a plus shit with d plus people watch your environment they will help you make sure your values stay where they need to go where they need to be so you can get what you need to have that's all i hope to have for today hope everybody has a great day hopefully that helps somebody out there um, i'm gonna get back to my workout stay inspired